When I'm getting close to a fight, you know, I, I like to have a, a bit of time myself sometimes, yo. So in the morning, I might go for a run. While I'm jogging, you know, I usually just, you know, think of the fight. Just get my, my headspace in the right mental frame, you know, when I really focus on what job needs to be done. It's a, a big fight ahead of me, so I like to, you know, get there and I sort of visualise how I think things are, are going to go, you know, and, you know, with fights that I've had previously, you know, I've, I've seen things that a lot of times that they happen, you know, things that you're working on, you know, you see it, you know, there might be a time in that fight where, where the opportunity's there and you've seen it so many times, you know, it's just boom, it's there, it's ready. Good, good. There we go. Well, that's beautiful. You know, you, I usually like a decent breakfast, so whenever I you know, already get a good workout, go get some, a bit of carbs, protein, a fair bit of protein here, but, you know, just whatever. But obviously, as I get closer to the fights, I, I sort of might cut out, you know, a bit of the bacon and stuff like that, but, you know, I end up, you know, sticking to oats and stuff like that. But right now, you know, I'm happy to eat, you know, good breakfasts like this, you know, I love it. Morning session, well, usually I'll be doing like pads and that with Joe. Yeah, we're, we're, we're doing some game planning, but at the same time, we're just training. You know, the last six weeks is where we'll really, wow. really fine tune everything. It's not fun in there when people spar me or, or fight me, so. That's what I do. It's later. Yeah. I'm, I'm a family man. That's me. That's why I do what I do. You know what I mean? The, the reason why I need to be successful is to look after them. So I don't don't think of fighting when I'm with the family. I'm, I'm usually I'm the type of person that you know, I just play what's in front of me. So when I'm home, I'm daddy. When I'm in the gym, I'm fighting. Who wants lunch? Cheers. Like I've had the heart rate monitor, and we do. 12, 1300 calories in one session. So that's uh, that shows you how how hard some sessions can get. Special recovery for for MMA fighters, for any athlete, you know, you've got to get the right foods in you. So you need that recovery. Recovery is everything. Alright. How are you, mate? Good mate, you? Yeah. Good, good. The ritual is I need to get a haircut fight week. You gotta stay sharp, mate, so the the haircut's pretty important. Everyone's always saying like it's so good to see someone from the Illawarra, you know, in the UFC and stuff like that. So the support in the you know you know locally has been unreal from you. Okay, mate. See you later. Yeah, Keep the speed. That's it. MMA and boxing, are, are, you, you transfer the force. So we're, we're trying to get strong through the hips and strong through the legs. That um, has the output awesome. upper body in through the arms and the punches. I'm doing this sort of stuff really, really gets that blood going and really gets you explosiveness. Is what, what I need because I get a, I can keep a really, really steady, grinding pace. But it, once I get that little bit more explosive as well on top of that, I'm gonna be a whole different beast. Two, three, nine. Guys, we'll go from the double to the single, yeah? The bad shot, then we're going to the single, yeah? Let's go. You gotta work control. I know everyone likes to see blood and likes to see people punch each other's head in. But um, you know, it's MMA, there's a lot of skill involved. And <laughs> if you can control someone without getting touched, beat them up on the cage, take them down, punch their head through the canvas, why not, yeah? Oh, 
Mate, I, I do so, I've done some hours in here. <laughs> Not many days I've missed. Just oh, showing yeah, them the Wall of Fame, Joe. Showing them the perm that you reckon's not a perm. The fun part is the fight. You're doing it all for that one thing, and that's that fight day. And yeah, that's the, that's the part you look forward to, you know. And and that's why a lot of the guys enjoy going into fight because, mate, the hard part's done. Yeah. Now it's the easy part. As Joe say, see that bag of cement over there? Go yeah, eat it hard enough. That's the emergency bag of cement. Fighting's the easy part. Preparation is is where you know the, the fight's won in the gym. Honestly, that's where all the hard work is, and that's where. You're gonna be ready. Hard training, fight easy. Yeah, compared to, you know, back at the start of my career to, you know, the, the end of the weeks used to be like I could barely move. But now from eating right and training right, well, I feel all right. I'm ready to go. All right, come on, Harry. All right, see you in the morning. See you later.